Waste management is an acute problem in Hong Kong. The major landfills in the region are expected to be filled by 2030, and the capacity is decreasing fast. At the same time, in compacting global warming, regions around the world, including Hong Kong, are aiming to reach carbon neutrality by 2050. The realization of a zero waste, zero carbon society requires combined effort and wisdom from policymakers, scientists, and the community. The scientific study of waste and wide ranging resources on our planet is highly complex and technical, requiring high tech infrastructure. At the Research Center for Resources Engineering Towards Carbon Neutrality, our members conduct fundamental and impactful research on the recycling of waste, such as woody waste, waste glass, and incineration ashes. The development of green concrete, such as eco blocks, is our major focus. Glass waste is a major component of solid waste in Hong Kong, and its recovery rate has consistently been under 20%. On the other hand, in the construction industry, concrete production accounts for about 8% of the global arthrogenic carbon dioxide emissions. Eco blocks are made through the use of construction, demolition, and other discard waste. It not only reduces the disposable waste, but also conserves the use of natural resources and the production of eco friendly construction materials. At PolyU, I have been leading a team of researchers in pioneering the development of eco blocks for over 15 years. On the PolyU campus, different generations of eco blocks have been put into use. The technology is now in its fifth generation of development. It is made by using recycled construction waste, waste glass, and incineration residues to replace natural aggregate and cement as major constituents of construction materials. We have also been applying carbon curing technology that boosts the performance of concrete. Carbon curing, in short, is the injection of captured carbon dioxide into concrete during mixing for permanent storage. By doing so, we can also cut down greenhouse gas emissions. EcoBlocks provide cost-effective solutions to the economy and environment, and an attractive alternative to traditional construction material in the long term. They cut down waste disposal costs and save landfill space for community. Lessen our reliance on the supply of natural material and help reduce mineral mining activities and their associated environmental impacts. More recently, I have been leading a project on the transformation of waste glass to low carbon construction materials. Using valorization technology, we will turn waste glass into a value added low carbon product for construction and infrastructures. Particularly, while valorization, we will transform nano glass powder into ultra high performance concrete, micro glass powder into durable plastic cement mortar, and glass colored into high strength permeous concrete. This will provide a total solution to waste glass problem in Hong Kong. After all, by conducting research and putting them into applications, we hope to provide solutions to the waste management problem and bring the society and the wider community for a greener tomorrow.